very willful boy. To it. What is one degree? Well, it's actually simple. One degree is derived from 60 minutes. 60 minutes. Remember that. One degree is equivalent to 60 minutes. He's back. Past several videos this person has made, he repeats the same falsehoods over and over and over again. Apparently, based on the comments for his videos, nobody's accepting his bizarre assertions, and to him, that means they just don't understand. So he keeps trying to explain it to him. And of course, just remember, always remember, always keep in your mind the good Lord Jesus and that 60 minutes equals one degree of arc. The same can be said for one degree is equivalent to 3600 seconds because one degree, 60 minutes, one degree is also in seconds because it's time. So in other words, 360 degrees that would be the fur, the full uh, circumference which equals 1440 minutes 360 degrees times 60 how much is that math professor here really needs some remedial junior high school education also what's with the porn film music One thousand four hundred forty minutes, or twenty-four hours, which makes a day, is to travel at three hundred sixty degrees. So, in other words, a full time lapse of a day, twenty-four hours, it can the star would travel three hundred sixty degrees around that circumference. That's right. It's the star going around the planet. It isn't the planet rotating under the star. I have a proposition for math professor here. And people watching this video, uh, maybe you would be kind enough to go to his channel. I will leave the link down here. And let him know that this video exists and that I have a proposition for him. And I am honest and I am sincere about it. <clears throat> so, Mr. Genius, let us go sailing. You navigate. Pardon the smirk, but I am completely sincere here. I will be captain because it will be my job to keep us, keep you from running us aground. But, but I will be the um, bareboat charter captain. So I have the credentials, and um, I'm thinking. The itinerary would be December 11th. We would arrive at the La Paz, New Mexico, uh, La Paz, Mexico airport. And we will, everybody rent, uh, rents a room at the same hotel and we spend the night there and we meet up somewhere in the hotel that evening and we'll get to know each other and we'll talk about the coming adventure and then in the morning, we get groceries enough for seven days, six nights. And then we take a aircraft shuttle to the marina. And there will be a lagoon, 380, waiting for us. This is a beautiful catamaran. And, I mean, it's just a luxury lot, uh, yacht. It has four cabins, uh, two heads with showers. Um, music system, Bluetooth, you pick the music as long as it's not really horrible. I won't, I won't mind, you know, whatever. So you pick two friends to go with you. I get two friends to go with us, so there'll be a crew of six. And it will cost each crew member about $1,000 for um, six days, seven nights on the vessel. And we will go sailing through the Sea of Cortez. And if you like, you can pick the destinations where we go sailing. And you bring your sextant and you get us there. I will keep a nautical chart secret with me so that I can plot our actual positions. So that we don't, you know, destroy the vessel and kill ourselves. 
and you just get us there we will anchor i have uh, a couple suggestions there's some really beautiful beaches there um i know of one where we can anchor off the beach and then there's a corral ring um, swimming place if you're concerned about sharks and barracudas and really hungry um, tuna whatever and we will have a really nice time. We will have a barbecue in the evening. There's a barbecue. It'll hang over the the stern of the vessel. Um, dinghy is included. A shitload of other stuff are included. And at night, we'll look up at the stars. And you will do the navigation for our next um, anchorage. What do you think? I figure $170 a night on a really nice luxury uh, yacht, I think that's worth it. And I'm ready to go. December 11th to December 17th is um, what I got the quote for. So that $1,000 per person, um, that's for the week. Um, $600, $660 of the entire fee it's uh, really close to six thousand dollars to do this at the charter uh, 110 dollars will be returned to each crew member because that's the damage deposit and as long as we don't damage the vessel we'll get that back 660 dollars total so what do you think mr intelligent person like i said i'm ready and willing to do this just take me up in the offer. We'll have a really good time. I've been through the Sea of Cortez a few times. Um, uh, I see no reason why you would not want to do this. Um, since it is Mexico, everybody will need a passport. Um, but there's plenty of time to get the passport because, I'm, like I said, December 11th. And the hotel room shouldn't be all that expensive because we book way in advance. So, Mr. Person, I will leave my email in the video description of this video. And you can talk, Matt, uh, contact me and say, hell yes, I want to go. I have two pals. They're ready and willing to go. Um, let's do this thing. And I will have two smoking hot babes um, with, um, for my pick. Um, I have the four tits already in mind. I mean, two women already in mind. And if you don't have a sex tent, we can borrow one at the marina, I suspect. We can go to the La Paz uh, Yacht Club and ask to borrow one. That's all good. So we'll have to leave a deposit for that. So, what do you think? Let's do this. I want to go. It'll be really good. Fun. Um... Get us where we want to go. I'll make sure that the anchor is down and holding. Um, I will take us from the dock and I will return us to the dock, etc., etc. Call me.